Hello, so today is Tuesday and I'm currently on my lunch break at work. So today's been weird because this week I believe they've made it a permanent sort of like health guideline that's during this whole COVID-19 that hospitals obviously but care homes with like residents in we've all got to pretty much wear masks now like all the time apart from when we're on our breaks obviously like now so people that work long shifts end up wearing about four masks a day morning to first break after first break to lunch from lunch until the evening break and then from putting people to bed sort of thing so it's really really bizarre the masks are horrible to wear but I feel a lot safer I know that the masks only really sort of as far as I'm aware it's stopping us from giving it to anybody else so for all staff to wear it we're stopping it from us to go to everyone else like it's kind of like we're being safe and stopping it from giving it to any residents and also from each other really because we're the ones that go out we, we go from the home to our home or from our home to shopping and yeah we're the ones that although once a week or whatever we've been out there so it, we are just being safe really because unfortunately although it is a bit like flu like with flu symptoms it's just more contagious so it spreads a lot quicker so in order to sort of like overcome this whole epidemic we've just got to put these measures in place and just sort of see if they work so this week we're trying it um yeah it's just it's strange so I've been wearing masks at work um with with everything so yeah that's bizarre so for the rest of my break i'm just going to do a bit of reading of weather i am past the half hour mark now so i'm just going to do a bit of reading just relax I had a horrible sleep sort of like this morning i just kept waking up three o'clock in the morning and then five o'clock in the morning and then six o'clock and i was just like i give up and i was getting quite hot this morning so that might have been why and then at another point i was really thirsty so yeah that's another thing but anyway i'm gonna head off now i just wanted to give you a quick sort of like let to know about it about what's going on and everything i'm just working today really and yeah today's my work day and yeah yesterday was just a day of pretty much relaxing reading and netflix i watched what did i watch it's it's called good morning call i think it is but it's a japanese drama i liked it like i'm addicted to it i'm probably near the end of season one already i watched loads of episodes yesterday i watched about three last night before going to bed because so i was really wide awake and like really alert and i was like well i watch it and then i was finally getting tired by the third episode so i was like well i'll stop now and then i started i think i was going to listen to an audiobook and then i was like nope i'm just gonna lay down and let it sleep take me and it did but then i woke up i woke up like midnight and then i woke up like three and then five and then six and i was just like oh it's so annoying just being so restless like that and it's been a while since i've actually like slept all the way through so yeah it's been crazy crazy mental but hey ho so yeah so i head off now so i can get some reading done a lot won't happen today because i'm at work um and i know that i've got some pizza waiting for me because when i got home yesterday i ordered pizza and chips and I had half of it, and I had all the chips, I had cheesy chips, I had cheesy chips, I had half the pizza, and I was like, why did I order this? And I got, like, the rest of the pizza at home, so I could have that, like, tonight for dinner. Then I could have, maybe if I don't eat all of it tonight, I could have some more for lunch tomorrow sort of thing. Um, 
I'm going over to Aaron's tomorrow. He's off today and tomorrow. Um, he's going to let me know whether I could go over tonight. I need to sort of really think of when I'm going to clean Cookie. I might just spot clean him. So maybe if I spot clean him tonight, because he's not actually that bad. And he wasn't that bad last week, so I might just spot clean and sort of get rid of the worst. Um, and then, yeah, give him some fresh bits, so that, that won't take long. So I might do that, but yeah, just see how it goes. Whether I'll be there tonight or whether I'll be there tomorrow. And then I've just got to empty my bins tonight slash tomorrow, so yeah. But that's all just a waiting game, just got to see later tonight when I finish work what the plan is. Um, and then most likely it will be Thursday where I'll probably do some shopping for my nan slash myself. So Thursday will probably be the shopping day. And then I could go home and check if she's got any mail for her. Um, and then that's really it. Other than that, I'm just, I'm waiting for certain things to arrive. Like I've, things I've ordered. I've ordered hair bleach cream peroxides for my hair. I've ordered blue hair dye. I've ordered a shower head, one of those ones with the balls in, that's meant to be amazing. And I've ordered the next book in the Chemical Garden Trilogy, the only one I don't own, so it's the middle book. And I'm trying to think of like what else I've ordered. But I, oh, and I've ordered, yeah, so along with the cream peroxides, I've ordered those from Amazon. So I don't know when they'll be in stock, but I had to put something with it. So I've ordered a book and it's Veronica Roth's new and latest book, Chosen Ones. So I've just put that along with it um, because otherwise I would have had to pay a stupid amount of postage. And I was like, well, I might as well just get something to go with it, to be honest. So I've ordered that. And I think I'm just going to be good with my purchases from now on because I've ordered everything now. So I won't do anything for like next month, really. So... I feel like I've had enough of purchasing things and yeah it feels like too much is going out in the past week or so and I'm just like nope I need to stop so yeah so yesterday was a chill relaxed day like I say just reading Netflix didn't game at all yesterday I even got home and I was like ah, I don't really want to game it's very strange um, and then I just waited for the pizza to arrive and then when I had the pizza I watched some friends and then I watched some a good morning call and then I went to bed like I was just like oh my god I'm actually addicted to a Netflix TV show like this is really cool so yeah maybe I'm into k-dramas now guys maybe that's the thing so yeah if there's any sort of like k-dramas or Japanese dramas or whatever that you recommend for Netflix let me know down below like I just I'm weirdly addicted <laughs> to this one, but if there's any others that just like it, let me know. Like, oh yeah, just I really, really like it. So yeah, so I'm going to head off now to do a bit of reading before I have to go back at 2. And then I finish work at 8pm tonight. And like I say, I'll just, I'll spot clean Cookie after I shower. So I'll shower myself and then I'll spot clean Cookie. And um, yeah, once I hear about what to do. I'll do that and then I can sort of deal with like emptying my bins either tonight or tomorrow. Exciting adult stuff. It's, yes, yeah, it's, it's pretty awesome. <laughs> so yeah, so I'll head off now to get those bits done. Um, yeah, you're pretty much updated for Monday and today. And I will most likely speak to you guys. If I don't speak to you guys tomorrow, I'll speak to you guys hopefully Thursday. But I'll try and speak to you guys very soon regardless. <laughs>
guys so today is friday and i'm just gonna update you on everything that's happened so far this week i can't remember the last time i actually vlogged for you guys i got a funny feeling it was a tree the beginning of the week so i apologize for that so i've worked once this week and then on the wednesday i went and saw aaron and then i stayed over the night and then yesterday thursday i came home and i did food shopping and i have been watching good morning call on netflix so i'm already like probably halfway through season two now I haven't watched any today didn't watch any yesterday when i got home i watched like one in the morning slash lunchtime with aaron um, yeah, he's kind of been watching it with me <laughs> and um, yeah, so I fired up Final Fantasy yesterday and I played about an hour or so's worth before I had to turn off and go to bed because of the whole like 10 to 7 quiet time and I've played once today already and that was earlier on just after lunch and I played a good I suppose hour and a half I'm just about to play again I rewrote my list of series that I'm in the middle of I just went into my goodreads and I rewrote the list because I've progressed in some series so my list was just looking very untidy so it was annoying me and I rewrote it again whilst watching some friends so I now have a fresh list I've got probably about close to 150 series that I am in the middle of most of which I have to start from the beginning of most of which I own copies of others I have on ebook so really it's just about what I'm in the mood to read so for example Shatter Me by Tahira Muffy I got to well, I, I got up to like the third book. I didn't read the third book. And now that there's more books in the series, it's been years since I last read it. So I'm starting from the beginning with that. So that's like for an example. Um, also, um, I've got uh, Untamed by PC and Kristen Cass. That's the fourth book in the House of Night series. That's another book I'm up to. And also... Darkest Minds, I need to reread the first book in order to continue on with that series. And The Archive, just want to reread that so I can read the sequel. Girl Online by Zoe Sarg, that's a reread so that I continue on with the series. Fifty Shades Darker, that's the second book I'm on with. Uh, yeah, and so on and so forth. There's loads of series I'm literally like in the middle of. Water Instruments is a book right here, book number five, currently in the middle of reading it. It just happens, you know, we all get in the middle of these books. Not a lot has happened really, I've just mostly been chilling and relaxing and um, got our new writer today for um, the next two weeks after next week, so sort of I suppose like mid-May and luckily for me it's like a duplicate of this week and next week so literally like for example this week I'm working Tuesday Saturday Sunday and the next week I'm working Tuesday Thursday Sunday and then the week after I'm working Tuesday Saturday Sunday and the week after that Tuesday Thursday Sunday so for me it's easy because it's the same days off and yeah there's not a lot of overtime because they have hired enough staff to cover periods of when we're short and all of that slowly slowly getting tired but it is the evening and it's coming out to 8 p.m i can't believe that so i'm gonna play like an hour or so of fun of fantasy remake just to satisfy my brain that i've played it a couple of times today and then i'll head to bed just so that i can try and like d media my mind like sort of what do they call it sort of like sleep i don't know it's like a routine before bed where you just sleep hygiene that's what they call it 
where you, you're not on your phone, you're not on any social media, you're just going down from the day so that you can sleep. So, yeah, so no TV, no PlayStation, no, probably no Kindle. So I, I can either listen to an audiobook or obviously of Lost Souls or I can start reading my ebook. So technically Kindle is okay because I've got a light on there that sort of like gets with a blue light. Um, but to be honest, even when I read my Kindle normally, I still get tired because my eyes are being used. So yeah, I'll just I'll just either read that or listen to the audio a bit later tonight or maybe a bit of both. Maybe I'll try a bit of both. Um, at some point this evening I need to Oh, I need to edit and upload a video for Saturday. So I I will have to do that after I play this. So I'll play this, get a video edited and uploaded for tomorrow, and then I will go to bed and read for work tomorrow. Oh, I always think like I'm not ready for work the next day. And I'm really not, like in the morning I'm just like, oh my god, I'm so not ready for say. But once I get the momentum going, give me, I think, at least an hour. My first hour at work, I'm always on autopilot. So after the first hour, I sort of like find myself, I find my ground, and then I'm okay. I somehow survive anyway, but yeah. On the last shift that I worked after my annual leave, I was like, oh my goodness, I'm so out of sync. But it actually went okay and the day went really fast, so I'm hoping that my days at work go fast. Time flies by when you're having fun, so I always try to have fun and enjoy myself. I like being organised, I like doing things, I like, you know, that's why I don't mind mostly doing the things, if that makes sense. Like, I don't mind organizing it I don't mind doing most of the work sort of thing like because I find when I'm doing something time flows a lot faster so I always give myself something to do even in the afternoons when it's a lot quieter sort of thing so yeah but it's the weekend as well and um we've got a good team at our weekend stuff so yeah um yeah got high hopes and all that and yeah so I'm going to head off now so that I can play this, do the video and then get ready for bed pretty much and do reading and stuff. So yeah, so I head off now and I'll try and speak to you guys at some point this weekend. I am working both days so I don't really know, it all depends if tomorrow goes alright and I find that I sleep okay and that work goes okay. I'll try and vlog for you guys in the evening after I've showered and all that. Um, other than that, I'll, I'll just try and find some time this weekend, maybe like during my break or something, I'll try and vlog for you guys, um, if I can remember, just to quickly update you on everything. So yeah, so that's it really from Friday, and I will speak to you guys very, very soon.